Australia is a land of diversity and mystery. From the vast deserts of the outback to the lush rainforests of the east coast, there's something for everyone to explore. But there's more to this island continent than meets the eye. Scientists have recently uncovered some truly shocking discoveries that will leave you on the edge of your seat. From deadly plants that have been hiding in plain sight to rediscovered creatures thought to be long extinct. So, get ready for an adventure as we explore the hidden gems of Australia. Make sure to stick around till the end as we've saved the most shocking discovery for last. 5. World's Largest Plant Imagine discovering a plant that not only holds the title of being the largest on the planet, but also a remarkable age of 4,500 years. That's exactly what researchers from the University of Western Australia and Flinders University recently discovered at Shark Bay in Western Australia. This giant plant, known as Poseidon's Ribbonweed, is believed to be the largest plant in the world. Thanks to its ability to clone itself from a single seed, it's expanded over a stretch of a whopping 112 miles. According to Dr. Breed, the suitable water conditions in the Shark Bay have allowed the plant to thrive and survive for millennia. But the discovery of this ancient plant isn't just awe-inspiring, it's also scientifically significant. Researchers are now delving deeper to uncover the secrets of its survival and growth with the hope of gaining new insights into the resilience of plants and the impact of environmental factors on their survival. And if you thought the size of this giant weed was magnificent, the next discovery is a lot smaller but deadly. 4. Poisonous Cone Snails Australia is home to an incredible array of marine life, including the elusive and deadly cone snail. These creatures, while small in size, pack a powerful punch with their venomous sting. Found hiding under sand, stones, and pebbles, as well as among the leaves and vegetation of the western parts of Australia, these cone snails are expert hunters, silently stalking their prey at night. These hunters use their proboscis to lure in unsuspecting victims. With one swift strike, they inject a paralyzing toxin before devouring their prey whole. Stay ahead of the cone snails. Don't be their next prey. Join the hunt for knowledge and entertainment with us. Subscribe to Space Unearth now. It's the painless way to stay up to date on all the new discoveries. The Cone Geographicus is one of the longest cone snails. It can grow up to 120 millimeters in length and has venom that can cause a sting similar to that of a bee. However, the pain and numbness caused by the sting can quickly worsen, affecting the victim's vision and respiratory system. Unfortunately, there's currently no anti-venom available for these cone snail stings. Despite their beautiful and aesthetic appearance, these cone snails are a reminder that sometimes things are not always as they seem. So, for the safety of all water enthusiasts, it's best to stay clear of these deadly creatures while exploring the waters of the Great Barrier Reef. If you think impressions can be misleading and dangerous, the next finding will force you to think about the power of plants. 3. The Gimpy Gimpy Plant The name of this plant is given because of the Gimpy town in Australia. It's derived from the language of the tribe of Gooby Gooby people. It's the local language of tribes living in northeastern Australia's rainforests. The Gimpy Gimpy plant is a true menace, known for its incredibly toxic leaves that inflict a sting that's widely considered the most agonizing in the world. According to research, there's currently no known antidote for this venom, making the plant a formidable threat to both humans and animals alike. But the Gimpy Gimpy's danger doesn't stop there. Its venom not only causes immediate pain, but it can also linger for years, causing ongoing discomfort and even driving some sufferers to take their own lives in order to escape the relentless agony. The insidious plant can be found growing near footpaths and creeks, reaching heights of up to three feet. Its heart-shaped leaves may appear innocent, but they're covered in tiny needle-like stinks that are the source of its venom. The sting itself is made up of a bulb filled with poison that, when punctured, releases the venom into the body. While the effects of the Gimpy Gimpy's venom can vary, they can range from instantaneous death to prolonged suffering that lasts for years. 
This was first documented in 1866, when a horse died after being stung by the plant's leaves in North Queensland. In 1963, Ernie Ryder experienced a similar fate, with the venom causing him to suffer through unbearable pain for days on end. The venom of the Gimpy Gimpy is incredibly stable and heat-resistant, meaning that it can remain active for years after the initial sting. It's been compared to the sensation of being burned with hot acid or shocked with electricity. With no known antidote and the potential for such severe and long-lasting effects, it's best to take precautions and avoid contact with the Gimpy Gimpy plant at all costs. Additionally, scientists and researchers continue to study the Gimpy Gimpy plant in hopes of finding an effective treatment or antidote for its venom. The next rediscovery is, fortunately, not poisonous. 2. The Extinct Cockroach Rediscovered Imagine exploring a secluded island and stumbling upon a creature thought to be long extinct. This is exactly what happened to Maxim Adams, a biology student at the University of Sydney. When he lifted a rock under a huge banyan fig tree on Lord Howe Island, to his amazement, he found a family of wingless, giant cockroaches, a species believed to have disappeared in the 1930s. Further research by scientists from the NSW Department of Planning and Environment revealed that these cockroaches had been hiding in plain sight on the island, relying on wood as their primary food source and avoiding detection for decades. However, their numbers have greatly reduced due to the arrival of rats on the island in 1918. This rediscovery is not only surprising, but it also holds great significance to the scientific community. Lord Howe Island is home to over 1,600 native species, many of which cannot be found anywhere else in the world, making it a unique and valuable habitat for research and the study of different species. So, the next time you see a cockroach scurrying across your floor, remember that there are still species out there waiting to be discovered. The next creature on the list finally lives up to its name. 1. Millipede with more than 1,000 legs Meet U. millipes Persephone, the millipede that actually has 1,000 legs. That's right, you heard me correctly, 1,306 legs to be exact. The word millipede means a thousand feet, but the name is a bit of an exaggeration. Until recently, scientists had only found a millipede with around 750 legs. With the discovery of this new species in Australia, scientists have finally assigned the millipede name to an insect worthy of the title. E. Persephone stretches around three and a half inches long and around a millimeter wide. The pale bug has a cone-shaped head, beaked mouth, and large antennae used for sensing its environment. The findings were published last week in Scientific Reports. The discovery of E. Persephone was made by biologist Bruno Buzzato, who was hired as an environmental consultant by mining companies. He found E. Persephone while surveying the area for local wildlife in August 2020. Buzzato baited traps with damp leaf litter, dropped them down 200 feet into boreholes, and later reeled up eight pale millipedes. He then sent the millipedes to Virginia Tech entomologist Paul Marrick, who studies the previous record-holding millipedes found in California. The researchers conclude that the ancestors of E. Persephone may have originated above ground hundreds of millions of years ago, before fleeing underground when conditions became hotter and drier. Because the team was able to examine only a handful of specimens, they're eager to see if other, even leggier, millipedes exist. In conclusion, E. Persephone is a stunning discovery, a marvel of evolution, and it's a testament to the importance of conservation and the ongoing need for scientific exploration. You never know, there could be a millipede out there with even more legs. The world is full of surprises, and we can't wait to uncover them all. Well, folks, that concludes our video on the fascinating world of Australia. We hope you enjoyed learning about these new discoveries. But before you go, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Your support helps us bring you more videos like this. So stay tuned, and until next time, stay safe and keep exploring.